their last movie together was Guess Who's Coming to Dinner. Tracy died just two weeks after its completion. And it was Kate Hepburn who discovered his body. His final speech in Guess Who's Coming to Dinner, I personally, I think, was one of the most moving things. I've never seen it. You've never seen it? No. Really? Never seen the picture. Why? Oh. It hurt too much. Couldn't look at the picture. These cubs are 14 months old. Just kids. Well, you really want to keep your wits about you. I mean, you've... You've got to, you know, because any moment, just in play, they just whip out and all of a sudden... You know, I don't remember. You know all my material much better than me. <laughs> Always the same story. Three and four-year-olds being lured into bubble baths with a man who sexually abused them. Having examined them uh, and, and talked with them, our unit's convinced that those children were sexually abused. Hands up. You obviously take no chances. Oh, just a matter of security, you know. We ended up at a deserted farmhouse where the IRA were waiting. They had already mounted a full-scale operation securing the area around the farmhouse. They maintained patrols the whole time we were there. And I like working with pros and I can't stand people who are less than enthusiastic. You've never suffered fools lightly, have you? No. We can fire live ammunition on both floors. Well, someday I'll be an old man that'll wheel me out of the stage, give me an honorary <laughs> Oscar, and turn me around and reel me off again. <laughs> like if them's not fighting words, I mean, this guy just wanted a stash. <laughs> She's proved that she has a very big heart. Ladies and gentlemen, would you please welcome our guest of honour for tonight, Diana, Princess of Wales. For many years, I really desperately wanted to please my mother and have her be proud of me, you know? Greg Norman. This is your life. Congratulations.